ಶಾರದೇವರದೆ ದೇವಿ ಮೋಕ್ಷದಾತಿ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ಪವನ್ ಬಾಲಿ ಅಂಡ್ ಐ ಮಹಮ್ಮದ್ ಆರಿಫ್ ರಫಿ ವಿ ಆರ್ ದ ಕೋ ಡೈರೆಕ್ಟರ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಫಿಲಮ್ಸ್ ಪವನ್ ಬಾಲಿ ಇಸ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದ ಇಂಡಿಯನ್ ಸೈಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಜಮ್ಮು ಅಂಡ್ ಕಾಶ್ಮೀರ್ ಶಿ ಇಸ್ ಶಿ ವಾಸ್ ವರ್ಕಿಂಗ್ ವಿತ್ ದ ಸೀನ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಐಪಿಎನ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಐ ಆಮ್ ವರ್ಕಿಂಗ್ ಫಾರ್ Pakistan in Telugu news channel Jio News Network and we are uh, the director co-directors of the film and we uh, and uh, Sean joined us at the post production level of the second film perceptions which which which, which I have con- conceived from uh, last 20 30 years it was not truly perfect perception about the people who are living across the line of control Pavan Bali she's not Muslim and and and, uh, and it was uh, another uh, memory for me that uh, the people who were living in the state of Jammu and Kashmir they have very co-existed society in the past and it should be in the future in its pure semantics how the river actually also got divided and yet you can't stop the water from flowing from one end to the other end but you stopped families from meeting from on 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 either sides of the river um, and then when we go to the faith you know you it's it's all transformative you know you can't trans- you can't stop faith from traveling from one one heart to the other heart the filmmakers didn't meet in the process they had no communication uh, while making this film so uh, i think it was as much as it was important for the stories to be documented and documented in the right sense it is also probably uh, important to to so you know you uh, know look at look at how the filmmakers changed and ca- came closer even without the communication uh, throughout this process so i think it, it, that's also for the first time that you know it's 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 kind of a blind a uh, spot where you don't know what's happening on the other side yet you keep hoping that it's happening in the right way i don't i don't think there was uh, you know this this intention of uh, showing the ruin, ruined uh, sites uh, we were only tracing back uh, places of uh, importance for for various faiths and uh, it is only uh, as a consequence of the divide that these places are now in the shape that they are right now which you know some of which happens to be ruined some of which happens to be not attended or not in the shape you know not people not visiting them but that is not to um, not to sort of project an image that you know it has been done purposely or or uh, they have been neglected purposely the idea be- behind it is as also not to 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 inflame uh, the anger of the communities that have attachments to that faith but the point uh, that we were trying to make is that you know had that divide not been there had these families still have access if these families still would have access to these places of worship and faith and if they were allowed for their annual pilgrimages to these places they might have been in a better shape if uh, uh, both uh, countries india and pakistan allow to the pe- to people to visit across the line of control to visit their religious places to to uh, to, to 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 allow to to go uh, on the other side of uh, the line of control it will be uh, the, the uh, situation will be totally diffi- uh, different you know i hope the people of the area will uh, will watch these films and uh, the rest of the world will when they 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 uh, watch these films they will be able to know about the factual position of the people people who are suffered from this divide they are asking about their rights they are asking about their civil rights their religious uh, aspirations that they are talking about their sorrows their hopes i also hope i mean somewhere within uh, you know not just not just these two films or three films but you know with the films that so many other filmmakers are actually making about various issues somewhere my hope is um, at one level not just to make uh, the the non kashmiri audiences aware about the situations back there but also to make the younger generations uh, in in the region 
uh, more aware and somewhere more receptive and responsible towards you know uh, uh, these stories and and their past and also uh, uh, at a very personal level i really hope that you know these kind of stories at some level make the you know the memories of separation a little less painful for these people